Hello to everyone, this is Adventure Story and today we'll talk about what actions should we take place uh, when we are in the machinery emergency when we have crankcase ignition. What means crankcase ignition in uh, quickly words? This is uh, an ignition when it happens, uh, when high temperatures occur inside the engine, when there is a friction between metal parts after that uh, the oil releases some mist okay this mist is a highly ignitable mixture okay when it uh, meets the oxygen the air okay if the air will mix with this uh, mist it's very dangerous for explosion and today we'll talk about what precautions we should take to avoid the explosion okay as you can see here we have two images how this mist occur in this area okay you can see there is a mist white color mist and uh, there is a suction from the turbo okay this is a turbocharger here as you can see clearly here in this part this is uh, in this place there is located a relief valve okay the relief valve uh, this is the purpose of relief valve to relieve the high pressure when uh, it's occur inside the crank space. Crank space is here, okay. If for some reason there is a relief of uh, relief valve, okay, this uh, oil mist, oil mist, uh, this mist can ignite because there is flammable mixture here, as you can see here and our engine room can set on fire okay I uh, we will read step by step the instructions okay when the engine is running the air in the crank case contains the same type of gas okay in the same portions as the ambient air but there is also a heavy shower of coarse oil droplets being Flung around everywhere. If abnormal friction occurs between sliding surface or heat is otherwise transmitted to the crankcase, for instance, from A, okay, from A, this is from A, I cannot see here number A, from A scavenging air, ah, from A scavenging air fire via piston root stuffing box. Or to the intermediate bottom, hot spots on the surface can occur. The hot spot will cause the oil falling into them to evaporate. As you can understand, the oil is falling to this surface and evaporate. When the oil vapor condense again, countless minute droplets are formed which are suspended in there and the milky white oil needs to develop. Uh, which we say before this oil, uh, oil is meat white color and uh, where I stop ah, here which is able to feed and and propagate a flame heat ignition occurs the ignition can be caused by the same hot spots uh, which cause the oil mist. If a large amount of oil mist have developed before ignition, the burning can cause a tremendous rise of pressure in the crankcase explosion, okay, which force a momentary opening of the relief valve in isolated cases when the entire crankcase has pressure between full of it. Okay, this is uh, this uh, thing right a lot of uh, how to say professional like that. Uh, professionally but uh, the most important for for us is here in case of an alarm of high mist high low temperature piston cooling uh, oil non-flow or scavenging box fire what we do we reduce speed to slow them down okay if not already carried out automatically because there is automatic safety system which uh, when I cure all mist there is all mist detector okay which will automatically give signal to safety system of the engine and will reduce the speed or slow down or 
or shut down the engine, okay? Ask Bridge permission to stop because of this uh, situation you need to communicate with Bridge and to discuss the situation. When the engine stops, close the fuel supply. We must isolate the engine. Switch off air blowers, auxiliary blowers, okay? The auxiliary blowers will supply air. We do not want this for the fire, okay? We need to break the triangle. And the engine room ventilation also needs to be shut down, okay? So we not supply fresh air to the engine. Leave the engine room. It's very dangerous because with explosion the doors can explode and the personnel can be hit. And lock the engine casing doors and keep away from them. Prepare firefighting equipment. Do not enter engine room until at least 30 minutes after stopping the engine, okay? Uh, you must be very careful if something happens like that, but mostly this case can case ignition happen. Happens in uh, all engines, okay? The engines which is not maintenance and also if uh, the scavenging space here under the piston is dirty or some rocks uh, what left from the scavenging cleaning it is also very dangerous uh, for fire but anyway there is a pressure relief valve which will relieve the pressure inside the crankcase all this pressure valve uh, relief valve is adjusted to a specified release pressure okay and you should give uh, attention for that because it's dangerous okay okay that is all that i like to say about this situation crankcase ignition you can read also the books about that but the best uh, way to avoid them is to maintain your engine clean your engine okay and follow the procedure okay thank you for watching stay tuned this adventure story for more marine videos bye bye